Hi guys, it's Amber, welcome back to my channel. For those of you who don't know, I live in central London. London's a pretty big area, and obviously it's split into sections. Different parts of London are known for different reasons. For example, central London is where all the good shops are. I'm thinking Oxford Street, Regent Street. Shoreditch is a really cool, edgy area with loads of graffiti and street markets. South London is known for the way that people talk. I have so many friends from South London and personally I find the accent really, really attractive. I guess you could say that there is a stereotype around that type of accent. The girls that have South London accents tend to be really feisty and edgy and I love that because that's exactly the type of person that I am. I stem from Yorkshire so obviously I have a completely different accent. I was recently spending time with a friend and he suggested that we do this comedy sketch which is basically when you see a a girl, you see a photo of a girl and you think she's gonna be really cute and innocent and shy, a very super well-behaved girl and then when you meet her it's the complete opposite. I don't want to give too much away for this comedy sketch but the whole story behind it is try not to judge a book by its cover. Yeah mum she's a really nice girl. No, she's not one of these Jamaican girls. Her name's Amber, she's, she's Catholic. Yeah, yeah, I know. Finally, a non-crazy girl. Listen, mom, I gotta go. Yeah, I'm, I'm by outside the house. Bye, bye, bye. Come in. Yeah, that's my purple. That's Your love is fading. Yeah, I'm coming for you. I'm coming for you. Your love, love is fading. My chocolate city, that's my chocolate city. I feel it fade, I feel it. I feel it. No, 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 no. so much for watching guys. I really hope you enjoyed that comedy sketch. Don't forget to give me a cheeky thumbs up if you enjoyed this video and of course comment below what you'd like to see me do in my next video. See you next time.